Okay, so so far we've learned that there's a bus on the outside of the diner and it's not travelling somewhere apparently. Where is this bus going? Investigating something. I'm just flagging the bus down. Who's this guy? This guy's the main character, isn't he? With the amount of focus we've had on him already. He's not some protagonist in a way. He plays into the story. Thanks for pulling over. Sure. Something wrong? We got a problem up ahead. A big accident. Close the road. Right. We're diverting all traffic through Little Hope. You okay, buddy? You seem a little confused. Yeah, I'm fine. I just want to get these folks to where they need to be. I doubt a short delay will trouble them too much. Head up the East Road. Takes you straight through Little Hope. Adds almost no time to your journey. Little hope, eh? I don't think he wants to be going through little hope. Because there's little hope of him making it out alive. Ah ha ha, so funny. No, but seriously, he shouldn't go little hope. Down, please. If music was enabled, that would have actually made us jumpy now. Bear in update. Let's have a look. A girl stood in the road, caused the driver to lose control and crash the bush. Well, there's nothing that I could have really done to avoid that situation, to be honest. Like, I couldn't control the character before this point, so it's not like I could have changed that narrative. Interesting. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah. Looks like some house? Hotel? Motel? B&B? House? I think it's a house. Stop it, James. 
You know I hate it when you don't take the things I say seriously. Come on, sweetheart, I do. I just had a rough day today. Can you believe they are at each other again? I can. You're drunk. What a surprise. I just caught the game with the guys, honey. That's it. That's not it. Never is. There's talk. Some of us may be losing our jobs. The factory... You've been saying that for years. I'm more worried about Megan. What's wrong with Megan? She looks okay to me. Everything looks okay after 10 beers. Reverend Boston <laughs> held her back after press today. It's four weeks running. She's not right. It's serious, James. You worry too much about that kid. I can't deal with this right now. Another surprise. You can't deal with anything. When would be the right time? You're making a mountain out of a molehill. Getting yourself worked up for nothing. For nothing? Single-handedly keeping our family together Sam? is far from nothing in my book. I could use a little help. Maybe if we'd had kids of our own, none of this would be happening. That's a real low blow. Don't you get how tough You're this not is the only me? one feels pressure. The factory situation is serious, Anne. Real serious. Not right now. Oof. He said not right now, Anne. Not tonight. No way. That's the girl that was stood in the road. Are we gonna get to control the character here? Anthony, Clark, family home, Massachusetts. She okay. always is these days. Uh, I don't know who she is. Give her a break. At least one of us is out having a good time. Give her a break. It's him I'm worried about. That guy's no good for her. All that new age bullshit. Reminds me of some creepy cult. <clears throat> he came in last week. We shot the breeze a little bit. I like him. That one's a classic. Legendary vinyl. Quit pawing at it, will you? <clears throat> so this must be the girl that was stood in the road, right? Hey, Bigfoot, mind the goddamn vinyl, will you? Like, it's an accident. That, no, it wasn't an accident. Just don't be a dick. Like. Come on, man. Take some time off from being a dick and give her a break. Okay, Mother Superior. Why are you always sticking up for her anyway? Just leave her alone, man. Like, there's no need to be a douchebag. There's just literally, there's literally no need to act like that. Like, fair enough, she shouldn't have acted out she did in the first place, but still, like, fighting fire with fire won't do this. I'm going to start climbing through the window unless that door gets fixed. Yeah, who's she? How's things? Let me guess. He's been pumping iron again. They've been at each other's throats since Dad got home. What's it about this time? <sighs> See what? He nearly fell through the front door. Some dad we got home. They're always fighting these days. Getting predictable, like a record that keeps playing over and over. Dennis, for the ten million time, will you ship that shit of yours up into the hey, attic? Some respect. This is a valuable, rare, and sought-after collection. Oh, this guy's a joke, and he's just an ass with everyone. I get it now. Makes sense. I think she was a marine sergeant in her past life. It's curled up his ass. He's been uh, Dennis be Dennis. Just Dennis doing what he's good at. Being really Dennis. A surprise. Hey Dennis. <laughs> hey! Not now, sis. I'm busy. It's the doll she's carrying. The ladder. Hey, quit acting crazy. Oh my god. Why have you got to creep up on people Jesus. like that? Just You're just chill. Me, like, what the heck? I heard you talking about me. Not now, Megan. I'd like to have a bath in peace. 
Take a break from this madhouse for a while? <sighs> Can't be scaring me out here. She got a key. Maybe you should talk to mom and dad. It's not a great idea for me to get involved. You know what I'm like? It just upsets me. They sounded more serious than the usual bullshit. They were talking about Megan. She's done something bad. I can't say I'm surprised. There's definitely something off with Megan. I don't get why everyone keeps picking on her. Okay, Mr. Shining Knight in Armor. Where's the little princess anyway? Megan's gone upstairs. Maybe you could go check on her? If you don't have other plans? I'll go find her. Press and hold to pick up objects and use your analog stick to uh, examine them. There's some on it, but I don't know what. Alright, just kept vibrating for no reason. Press X to interact in time with the heartbeat. Okay, Jacob's holding the second goal of the game so far, and he picks up the puck out of Teddy Green's banner start a second time. That one's right between Chief and Clyde, so we can go six to the left behind. Chief is starting to go down. Oops. I don't know what I was meant to do with triangle, but I failed. It's okay, Dad. Tanya's checking on her right now. You want to try raising a family like this? The devil himself would struggle with you guys. Uh, that's why that kid's such a dick. He's got more of his dad's traits than his mom's. Okay, that makes sense. Check on Tanya, move. Let's go. Finally get... Finally, get control of a character. Feels good. Well, we don't need to go outside because you're not there, is she? And that's just a scary thought. I don't know what the... What's this? Megan Clark. Attendance. What's this? What's the days? Attendance. One, two, three, three. Okay. Interesting. What else is around here? I'm thinking of this corner. Okay. It's over here. Oh, there's the thing that you put on the stove. Son of a bitch, Clark. <sighs> Freaking stupid Clark. Who even put you there? Okay, I thought the chair was just going to move then. That would have been a bit freaky, but we're good. Just making sure there's nothing around that I can examine. Yeah. It's over here. Nothing. What about... Why does it like keep signaling me towards doors? I don't want to go out into the cold. I'm scared of what lurks outside. Hey, Tanya. You up there? How's Megan doing? Don't know. Haven't seen her yet. Keep it down, will ya? Trying to sleep here. Now you've done it. Trying to sleep here. Forget him. Find Megan. Relax. I'm on it. Do me a favor. Quit yelling for a couple of minutes. House could use some quiet. Uh, just polite. Don't need to sure, be no problem. Not another sound. Place is crazy enough without you two cents. It's all the noise about anyway. Just checking in with Tanya and Megan. Good luck with that. Megan's a handful. Some deadbeat dad, man. I guess we're back in here again. Oh, there's something shining through there. I wonder what that could be. Let's go and investigate it. Okay, we've got some mini bar. What's this? Shroud of Innocence. 
A must read for anyone with an interest in Salem, which trials in 1692. Okay. Nothing of real importance in there. Right, what's this over here on the table? More witch stuff. <laughs> so. Oh, pick it back up, pick it back up. I ain't turning it over. I just want to look at this a little bit more. So there's something to do with witch trials around here. I wonder what that means. Little old museum, 7.99. Okay. So someone has been up to some weird cult stuff, like someone was saying. Anthony, where are you, God damn it! What? Anthony, I'm getting really pissed off. Why are you shouting from outside? Anthony, uh, why? You why are you shouting? Uh, what is Megan doing? You could be right about my family. Who's she talking to? I think so too. Bruh. What's going on? That little brat locked me out. It's fucking freezing. I'll let you back in. Go easy on Megan. Hold on. She locked you out because she didn't want you to die in the fire, bro. Oh my god, this kid is crazy. Shit! Megan! You in there? The kitchen's on fire! Are you fucking serious? You need to get off the balcony. I don't think it's safe to be up there anymore. Megan! No one's getting safe from that house. Mom! She's gonna Where the hell is everybody? Smoke. He's got to get out of his ass, huh? Oh my god, this is crazy. Help! Oh, Anthony! Hey! Up here! I bet he slips off the roof, man. What the fuck are you doing up there? Oh. I got trapped in the attic. The spikes get below to the balcony! Oh. Anthony, help! Why don't you just use a weapon, like? Finally, brain cell. I can't breathe. See, we may fall through. And the girl who just stood there, like. And she's suffocated. How did that dollar just fly up? Oh my god. No, 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 no. Ah! Ah, this is why, why? Why decisions? Why? Help Megan, help Tanya, help Megan, help Tanya. I'm gonna help Tanya, man. You were a demon child, you mate. Anthony! Help! What should I do? Climb down the drain pipe. Yes. Get to the drain pipe and climb down! Please don't slip on the drain pipe. Oh no. Dream pipe looks so. Come on, lady. 
Take your freaking time. Well, maybe you should have took the window actually, you know, Tanya. Because now we just lost two people. If we'd, have taken, if we'd have put him in the fire, like, there's a chance he could have died too. I'd have took the I knew that was gonna happen, bro! Oh my god, that is freaking disgusting! Ooh. Did he run inside? Is he feeling okay? Why? What? What?